Hey guys, today we are talking about the 2022 market forecast. Welcome back. This is Cole and Kelly Watkins with The Bridge Group EXP Realty, and we're excited to share with you guys our predictions for the 2022 real estate market. We're going to be sharing a little bit about what happened in 2021 and what experts are saying is going to happen in 2022 and then what we predict as well. All right. So, Kelly, what is this first slide up here? This is comparing the Houston real estate market in 2020 compared to 2021. And the crazy thing is 2020 was a record breaking year for real estate in the Houston market. And guess what? 2021, of course, broke broke those records as well. Yeah, and even before 2020, uh, the, the previous six years were all record breaking years in the market, you know, and 2021 was as well. You know, I want to draw your attention to the 16% on the second to last row single family average sales price, you know, has gone up from 324,000 to 376,000, 16%. But I feel like we're not going to see that aggressive of a appreciation uh, this year and next. And the other interesting thing about this slide is that the total volume went up by 31.8%. So we did 30% more we sold 30 percent more real estate in the houston area in 2021 versus 2020 and that's how we've been keeping so busy this is exactly what we were just talking about in the previous slide home pricing forecast we saw 16 percent on the previous slide they're predicting 5.2 percent to 7.4 percent to 2.8 percent they're kind of all over the place but the ones that gave the highest predictions 7.4 and 7 percent are fannie mae and freddie mac and the good thing is is that they're typically the most conservative when it comes to forecasting home prices. So what we're gonna see here in the next couple slides is our interest rates going up. If the interest rates go up, then our inventory might start, you know, building a little bit more days on market. When the days on market increase, uh, then that's when your prices start to normalize. So this slide is showing you the interest rates since 2018 and how they've gone up and down over the years. And in the red is the prediction of where they're going. And experts are predicting that interest rates will go up this year. Some are saying as high as 3.7% in the fourth quarter. But if you think about it, going from, you know, 3.25, kind of where we are now, to 3.7 really isn't that big of a difference, you know, when it comes to your actual mortgage payment. Yeah, it really isn't. And I would encourage you if you want to find out exactly how much more that might be is to talk to a lender. When we look at 3.7%, if that's the highest that it goes, mm -hmm. it is still historically one of the lowest interest rates uh, we've ever had. So what this slide is showing is how home ownership is a hedge against inflation. So historically, you can see since the 1970s that pretty much inflation rate was always less in the appreciation prices of home and we see we saw that in 2021 we saw the inflation rate was 6.8 percent and the home appreciation prices in the u.s were 18 percent a lot of our investors a lot of our first-time home buyers are wanting to put their money and their cash into property a physical asset because they know that it's going to be appreciating over the years we have clients from saudi arabia that, that are putting their money in houston real estate because they know that this 18 percent hedge against inflation is the smartest thing to do with their money and protect the funds that they've accumulated. So predictions for 2022, the interest rates will go up slightly, but the in inventory is also gonna go up slightly. So it's definitely gonna stay a strong market. We have all the builders out there, all hands on deck, building properties for our buyers. And a lot of our buyers are going that route versus finding a resale property because there's less competition. So we do feel that the interest rates will go up, but the inventory will stay, still stay very low in general, so that it's gonna be a very strong market in 2022. You know, if you're a seller, you can definitely uh, have a massive advantage in this market, but if you're a buyer, the same thing, you're still having extremely low interest rates and you're buying in an appreciating market. So your property is bound to appreciate and be worth more probably by the time you even close right. <laughs> uh, th than when you bought it. And no buyer is gonna look back, say 10 years from now and regret having bought it a property, they're going to be thrilled at the prices appreciation over the past 10 years in general. So that's something to keep in mind if you're a buyer. And if you're a seller and you're a little bit nervous, because a lot of our sellers are just saying that right now, where am I going to move to? Please reach out to us. We have strategies for our for our sellers to make sure that they have a place to move into before they are kicked out of their home by the new buyer. And we can also keep your, mar your property off market and just keep it as what we call a pocket listing because we have so many buyers out there that are flexible on timing that may work for you. So there's a lot of options for our sellers as well. So please reach out to us today if you're a buyer, seller, or looking to lease in the Houston area, and we'd love to help you. We'll see you next time.